Now, the Chinese government is cracking down on Halloween celebrations in Shanghai as they fear the festivities could serve as a platform for political dissent. Our Asia correspondent Nicole Johnson has more. People in Shanghai were bracing themselves for a big Halloween party today, but it's not happening. We've been in the main nightclub area of the city. There is a heavy police presence on the streets and bar owners say that they've been told that there'll be no people allowed out and about with costumes. This all started last weekend when people started to come out dressed as Spider-Man or a Buddha or a fake police officer. They were taken away by the police and made to remove their costumes and uniforms. It seems that the police don't want a repeat of last year's Halloween when many people came out wearing costumes that poked fun at China's leaders and the country's policies. So Halloween, it seems, is pretty much off for this year. It means that you can't dress up too much. And anyway, people don't dare to go out now because of the restrictions. If some people come out on the streets, the police will say, you can't wear that. You either go home now or take off your costume. In Shanghai, the only place where you can wear a Halloween costume is at home or in a couple of designated areas, not here out on the streets. You have to remember that this city had the biggest protests against COVID restrictions two years ago. So in Shanghai, authorities are sensitive to public gatherings. And for young people, Halloween is a chance to let off some steam because here in China, there is almost 20% youth unemployment. But for officials here and for the Chinese government, it's all about maintaining social order and public image.